Let's go outside with Jeff Marr, who is ready to do a little science project, Jeff. Yeah, I'm ready for a, a little change of pace. I, I'm still sweaty, Kiba, from that dodgeball workout, even though it only lasted about a minute. Just shows I'm a little bit out of shape. But anyway, we're going to learn about science. And what amazes me about this school is the professional hands-on experience that the students get here, even with forensics. Can you believe that? Forensics. Look at this. We have an actual crime scene out here what looks to be a crime scene. This is something that the students do to learn more about criminalistics. I'm going to bring in Jessica O'Donnell, who is one of the reporters as part of that student broadcast you just saw. Jessica, explain what we're looking at here. Um, well, what happened in the quad is that somebody seems to have been murdered and the culprit left their footprints on a trail. So uh -huh. the students are going to be out here today and they're going to be seeing who done it. It's kind of like a game of Clue, huh? Yes, exactly like that. And I want to bring in Professor McCurdy I, I should want to bring you in to talk more about this because I find this to be incredibly interesting. In, in my high school, if you wanted to be a police officer, let alone forensics investigator, you had to wait until college. Absolutely. But in high school, look at this. They're actually matching the shoes to the prints and trying to figure out who, who uh, committed this crime. Absolutely. Yeah, so these, uh, these shoe prints here are, are visible or patent shoe prints. Um, and so a forensic scientist can look at a shoe print and determine the size, the color, the type of shoe, and most likely the brand just from looking at a shoe print. And do you have students who are already pretty set on getting into this field? A few, yes. Uh, a couple of people uh, had uh, their eyes set on other areas and they took criminalistics and they said, wow, I really want to really get into this now. And, uh, and I encourage them to take a science course in college and uh, major in science and then they can do a graduate school uh, in forensic science. Okay, can I just show you my shoe just to make sure Absolutely. that I'm not one of the the, the suspects you know can you look at the bottom there is it any matches do you see any matches there am I good I'm clear you're not gonna book me okay Kiba good news out here from Kasumnas Oaks I'm not gonna be charged if I'm charged with any crime it's gonna be uh, in a few minutes when I go to the food lab <laughs> and I start stuffing my face with appetizers does that sound good yeah uh, we're gonna work and pull together maybe some bail money for you Okay, sounds good. Okay, yeah. we will see Sounds you in fun. just a little bit. All right, Jeff. Okay. Thank you.